Welcome to our comparison video on switching from 265 70ths R17 to 275 65ths R18. The diameter difference between 265 70ths and 275 65ths is 1.5%, which is within the acceptable range, making this interchange suitable without major adaptations. However, the slight increase in diameter might still require a brief check for any potential rubbing issues. Switching to 275 65ths increases the diameter by 0.47 inches, providing slightly higher ground clearance. This small enhancement benefits off-road driving by improving the vehicle's ability to navigate rough terrain, while the impact on speedometer reading is minimal. The width difference between these two sizes is 0.39 inches, with the 275 65ths being wider. This wider tire offers a larger contact patch, which can improve traction and stability, particularly useful for both on-road and off-road driving conditions. The 275 65ths has a sidewall height decrease of 0.27 inches compared to the 265 70ths. This reduction may result in slightly less impact absorption, potentially affecting ride comfort on rough terrains. However, on paved roads, the effect is negligible, and handling may feel a bit more responsive. Due to the change in tire size, the speedometer will read slightly lower than the actual speed. For example, at a speedometer reading of 20 miles per hour, the actual speed will be approximately 20.3 miles per hour. Based on our observation, switching from 265 70ths to 275 65ths brings both benefits and shortcomings. The larger diameter and width enhance ground clearance and traction, beneficial for off-road adventures and improves stability. However, the reduced sidewall height might slightly affect ride comfort on rough terrains, though it provides better handling on paved roads. Overall, this switch offers a balanced improvement for drivers seeking enhanced off-road performance without significant drawbacks for on-road driving.